guys today we are traveling to we are going to Hampi and uh, the plan is now it's around uh, 3 o'clock so the plan is to stay at Chitradurga today and then from Chitradurga tomorrow morning we'll leave to Hampi so I'll share you all the things what we experience on the journey the distance between Bangalore to Hampi is 340 kilometers since we left home in the evening after our work, we thought better to have an intermediate stay in Chitradurga overnight, which is about 200 km from Bangalore, and then continue to Hampi next day onwards. Highway from Bangalore to Hampi is really good, except in Tumkur Highway where you experience the roads are distorted at some places. So just cross the Karjivana Halli toll booth now. Hi guys. So we stopped a bit over here. Uh, we are about, it's about 90 kilometers to reach to Chitradurga now. So it's, it's uh, almost 6 o'clock and we thought. So we have just made a stop here uh, uh, just to have some snacks. It's, it's almost, it's almost evening now and uh, we were quite hungry and uh, my husband had already bought some snacks from the bakery and uh, thought we'll uh, just stop here and have it. Uh, we have uh, still more uh, 90 km 90 kilometers to reach to the reach to Chitradurga. So we'll have some snack and then. guys if you're liking the video so far then don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification on so that you don't miss my future videos once we reached the room it was already night so we then headed out to have a light dinner so hi guys so we have reached uh, Chitradurga here so we'll stay uh, for a night here and tomorrow morning early morning we will go to the Chitra Durga fort yeah and after that then we'll move on to Hampi which will be around uh, 100 kilometers from here 100 140 kilometers from here so from Bangalore it took about uh, around three and a half hours to reach here we left it around four o'clock and we reached here uh, by 7 30 or so uh, it was about 200 kilometers uh, of the distance journey and the roads are really good the Tumkur highway and uh, Mumbai highway yeah it's called as Mumbai highway I guess yeah that's the road is really good and wide so not an issue so you'll reach pretty fast three and a half as for 200 kilometers is uh, it's really good yeah so for today that uh, for, tr for today that's it so tomorrow morning we'll be heading towards the Chitra Durga fort. Hey guys, so we came out uh, to have uh, something light. So there was a, a vegetarian restaurant uh, nearby named uh, Hotel Upadhyay. We just had light food here because we didn't want to, you know, stuff with the heavy food uh, today. Because tomorrow again we have to try it, right? Here uh, in Chitradurga, there is uh, no much places to explore. And in Chitradurga, there were not many options to uh, lodge, but we found a, a pretty decent place called uh, Sai Comforts. Okay. Uh, it was a budget hotel, but uh, the cleanliness was uh, maintained. So 
we are back to our room now so basically this was just an intermediate stay uh, since it would be a long journey to, to go towards Hampi and uh, we had to leave the home at uh, leave Bangalore at uh, around evening time so I was uh, we just thought it's it's best if we uh, stay overnight somewhere in between like Chitradurga here and then leave for Hampi the next day so we didn't find any much options here just found, found one hotel this is hotel named uh, Sai Comforts got uh, it's, it's a decent kind of uh, hotel a budget hotel we, uh, I would say and it had some good ratings so we, we came over here and uh, this hotel seems to be uh, like it's a new one but it's good just for one night stay or something like that if you are going for intermediate stay somewhere if you're going on the long journey then you can come over here at this place yeah and uh, tomorrow we have to wake up early and uh, go to Chitradurga fort it has a very historical significance just want to see how uh, the fort is uh, really to see yeah if you are also like uh, going to Hampi then you can in intermediate stay and uh, I must say that in Chit in Chitradurga, there are no, no much places to explore other than Chitradurga Fort and uh, to stay wise there are no much uh, lodges available. This is the uh, one place that uh, we could find which was kind of decent and yeah so if you are also planning for something similar then you can stay at this place. It's pretty good and uh, it's uh, safe as well. It has got all the CC uh, camera facilities so it's kind of uh, safe. Okay that's it for today we'll just uh, freshen up and then hit on bed and uh, then wake up early for tomorrow yeah so see you tomorrow